Welcome to Philosophy in Review. In this episode of our Stoic Philosopher series, we will discuss the philosophy of Chrysippus. Chrysippus, who lived from 279 to 206 BCE, was the third head of the Stoic school of philosophy and is considered to be one of the most important Stoic philosophers. As an eminent Stoic philosopher he excelled in logic, the theory of knowledge, ethics, and physics. He created an original system of propositional logic in order to better understand the workings of the universe and role of humanity within it. He adhered to a deterministic view of fate but nevertheless sought a role for personal freedom in thought and action. Chrysippus's system of propositional logic was a major advance in the development of Western logic. It serves as the basis for many disciplines today, such as advanced mathematics and computer science. Propositional logic studies the logical relationships between propositions taken as a whole. It primarily involves studying logical connectives as well as the rules for determining the truth of the propositions they are used to join. These rules are used to test the validity of arguments. Propositional logic is also concerned with relationships between statements as being consistent or inconsistent with one another. In ethics, Chrysippus held views similar to most other Stoic philosophers of his time. This view was that the goal of life is to live in accordance with nature. He believed that the universe is governed by a divine providence, a rational whole, and that the wise person will live in harmony with this concept. As was the case with many of his contemporaries, he thought the goal of life is to achieve eudaimonia. Eudaimonia is often translated as happiness, but it is more accurately understood as flourishing or living well. He asserted that we can achieve virtue by training our minds and bodies. It was his opinion that we need to learn to control our emotions and to act in accordance with reason. Here are five quotes from Chrysippus. 1. The wise man is not disturbed by events, but by his judgments about events. 2. The only good is virtue, and the only evil is vice. 3. We are what we repeatedly do. Excellence, then, is not an act, but a habit. 4. The mind is everything. What you think, you become. 5. The only thing that is constant is change. Thanks for watching. Please like this video to let us know if you enjoyed it. Also, feel free to comment with your suggestions or ideas.